You look like you're a million miles away. Yes, I was. I was thinking about this friend that I, I used to know very well. Used to know? I'm trying to figure out. I thought I'd take a walk down here, see if I can clear my head. Well, the sea air has a wonderful way of solving problems. Wish we were that easy. Do you mind if I walk with you? No. Now, just how long do we have to walk before you begin to tell me what's on your mind? But it began that sort of thing. Then Sean, all this time. I mean, I would hate to think I was wrong about him after all. Didn't you see it? Trust your instincts, Hannah. Instincts don't come for anything with the evidence that I heard today. Well, do you doubt Sean after all these years? I don't know. How can I accuse him of killing someone? Years that we spent together in WLC, we, we, we built, we built a strong bond. Now, you know, I, I don't want to throw that away. It would be like throwing away a part of myself. Well, it sounds to me as if you're talking as if Sean is in this alone. I mean, how do you know Monica Quarterman is in this? I don't know Monica, but she'd never kill anyone. Passion can do strange things to a person, Anna. Monica's a doctor. Well, then you'll have to come up with some other explanation. I don't know why I'd rather talk to you. I don't know why, why are you supposed to speak to me? I love you, Emma Devane. Oh, I love you too. I love you. <laughs> Sorry, Duke, but uh, I'm sorry, but something's come up that needs your attention. You can wait, Angel. No, no, we can't, Duke. It can't. We got a problem with the help. Right. Are you sure? Yes, yes. Are you sure? Are you sure? Bambina. I spent the whole afternoon chasing Luigi and Francesca all over the park. Yeah. You should have seen them with the front feet. They finally got the hang of it. They did? Oh, I hope they don't tell Mariangela about climbing that tree. You not have to climb trees, Grandma. It's a fact of life. Oh, yeah? How come it's not a fact of life when I was a little girl? Oh, I think she just makes it up as she goes along. <laughs> Mommy? Mm-hmm. Why do you keep looking at the phone? Are you expecting a call or something? Yeah, I'm waiting for someone to call me back, actually, yeah. Is it Uncle Duke? Oh, that is not your business, Bambina. One rule that never changes is that children must learn to respect their elders. That means I was right. You are expecting a call from Uncle Duke. You are incorrigible, you know that. Did I get that from you or Dad? From your father, most definitely. Is incorrigible good or bad? Well, it just depends on how much I've patience and have at the time. I'll get it. Hello? Hi, yes, she is. It's Mary Angel. She wants to talk to you. Oh, uh, tell her I I'll take it in the, in the living room. She'll get it in the other room, okay? Uncle Duke, isn't it? Am I wrong? Uh, well, I sometimes just think that you're a bit too smart for your own good, young lady. Do you love Uncle Duke? Yes, I think perhaps I do. <laughs> Another wedding? Oh, darling, it's a little bit too soon for that. Oh, 
Huh? He's almost as nice as my daddy. Please say you're marrying him, Mommy. I don't know, Maybe I know. <laughs> Maybe I'm not seen it coming. And from what I saw in the docks, it's happened. You're in love with the Duke. What am I gonna do, man? Huh? What am I gonna do? Don't ask me. Don't ask me. You're gonna marry a lady cop? Oh, nothing would please the boss more than to see me married to the chief of police, huh? You are in love with her. That's why I can't marry her. I can't put her in that danger. Well, it's all my fault. If you hadn't met my friends, you'd be free to marry her. No, it's not your fault. I can never marry her. It's not your fault, man. We all make our choices. I have made my choice. I can't marry Anna today. 